Orchids are extremely picky. They make up 10% of the world's plant species. So there's this huge diversity and they each have sort of their own little set of conditions. And that set of conditions is really strongly determined by their associations with other species. So all orchids require associations with fungi and they have to have particular fungi. For most plants, there's a nice exchange of nutrients. So the plant is photosynthesizing. It has more carbon than it needs. The fungus has access to nitrogen and phosphorus and other nutrients in the soil, and it has more of that than it needs, but it needs carbon. So they're able to do an exchange of nutrients. Orchids kind of turn this on its head. I mean, they cheat their fungi. They actually eat them. They digest the fungi that are present in their roots. So the fungi grow into the roots of orchids. They form these really tight coils of fungal material within the plant root cells. And then the orchid is able to break them open and to absorb the nutrients from the fungus into the plant. All orchids in nature require associations with fungi in order to germinate and grow. 